Hey, what's up everybody? True Boxing here. Thank you for coming back to get hit with the truth. So today we are doing the preview for this Saturday DAZN's um, main event that is going to see Juan Francisco Estrada defending his 115 pound title against um, the current, well, I, I think he gave up his belt at uh, Flyweight and moving up to Super Flyweight, the undefeated Jesse Bam Rodriguez. Um, this is a, if you guys are not excited about this fight, you should be. Now, I know, I, well, let me get back to that. Um, if you could smash the like button, leave a comment, or subscribe to the channel, I really do appreciate any and all support that I can get um, as I continue to build my channel here. So, if you are not excited about this little guy showdown right here, then you're tripping balls. This is the best fight under 122 pounds for any way fights that we can get right now. Juan Francisco Estrada is the king at 115 pounds. That's super flyweight right here. He is the king. He defeated, um, he has wins over uh, Rungzavai, um, and uh, I think two wins over Rungzavai. And then he also defeated Chocolatito in back-to-back -back fights very close fights though very close fights so um that was his uh latest uh big fight victory but he is absolutely the number one fighter at 115 pounds and he's battling the number one fighter from 112 who is a former champ from 115 jesse bam rodriguez this is a big big fucking fight between two little guys and again, I don't really, I don't generally cover um, Bantamweight on down, you know, from 118 down, um, you don't, um, you don't get a ton of, uh, you know, big fights and, and, and it's not, the media doesn't widely pay attention to those guys, but um, certain guys like Chocolatito and Estrada and, and Rodriguez stand out. And this fight right here is going to be all fucking action right here. You got the veteran Estrada, um, been around for a long time. He's been in wars. He's worked hard to build himself up to be the top guy. And now he's taken on the um, next top guy, projected to be the next top guy in Jesse Bam Rodriguez. Uh, Bam, uh, you know, moved down to 112, regained a title last year after um, a stellar run at 115, where he knocked out Rungzavai, um, probably had the best performance against um, Rungzavai than anybody did, uh, stopping him. Um, and and now, you know, and then he moves down to 112, and he dominated Sonny Edwards in a unification bout last year. And now, again, this is the biggest fight that can be made for Jesse Bam Rodriguez. He didn't want to fight Chocolatito. He wanted Estrada. And now Estrada, who narrowly defeated Chocolatito, wants to prove why he's the king of, of anything 115 and under. So this is a huge, huge fight right here between these two guys. Um, you know, even me, the, 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 the little guys don't get so much love that I have to keep getting reminded about this fight. I keep forgetting about it. And I think it's a great fight, and I can't keep it in my head um, for some reason. And um, I went to go look at the schedule to look at the undercard of Lopez and Claggett, which I think that's a trash-ass main event on ESPN. And I saw that uh, this fight on the schedule, and I went, oh, shit, right on. So this Saturday, you're going to see an all-out war between these two little guys right here. And I think it's going to be good. Is it going to be a passing of the torch? Or is it going to be the, hey, son, you're not ready yet. Estrada spanking the, the younger guy's ass. My prediction, my official prediction, I'm going with Jesse Bam Rodriguez. I think he's going to be the new king at 115. I think he's going to beat Estrada. I think he either stops him in the late rounds or he gets a, a decision victory. It could be close, though, because Estrada is that good. Um, but I think if you compare what they've done against recent guys, I think um, I think Rodriguez showed against Rungzavai just a couple years back that 
he is on a different speed and power level than guys like um, Rungzavai, Chocolatito, and Estrada. And I think he's going to prove that against Estrada. But, again, Estrada could absolutely win this fight and prove why he's the best once again. So, um, huge, huge fight right here. Can't wait to see it this Saturday, June 29th on, um, on DAZN. Make sure you check it out. This is the preview and prediction for Estrada versus Rungzavai for the WBC Super Flyweight Championship at 115 pounds. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, smash the like button, leave a comment, or subscribe to the channel. I appreciate any and all support. This is True Boxing. You've been hit with the truth.